And it is the turn of the second gentleman. So In often many situations, odds that were designed to break them, to demoralize them, to cre create and, uh, its systems and situations that were to make them feel like less than humans, less than full human beings, but yet they survived. And they tell another history a history of endurance, a history of faith, a history in believing what is possible, a history not only that tells about the ability that each individual has to survive but to thrive. And so all these stories must be told. All these stories must be told in a way that we take from this place the pain we all feel, the anguish that reeks from this place. And we then carry the knowledge that we have may gained here toward the work that we do in lifting up all people, in recognizing the struggles of all people of fighting for, as the walls of this place talk about, justice and freedom for all people, human rights for all people. So that's what I take from being here. The descendants of the people who walked through that door were strong people, proud people, people of deep faith, people who loved their families, their traditions, their culture, and carried that innate being with 